Hey guys, welcome to another video. Uh, what was that? I'm back to show you some um, of my new props uh, that I just got yesterday, actually. And uh, I know that we're not even done building the actual haunted house or anything, but I thought it might be a good time to show you some of them because I just got them and uh, I haven't uploaded really anything for a long time. So sorry about that. I just didn't ever get around uh, to it with it. That was weird. So yeah, um, I'm going to show you some of the new things I got and I also got my costume and you might not know, like, it might not make sense to you, uh, my costume, because I haven't even went into detail about, you know, the layout of what the heck is going to be like in each of the rooms and I will do another video about that. But today, let me just show you some of my props. So first things first, oh, I will show you the costume. You know, um, there's another part of it. Yes. Wait a minute. And here it is. Pretty much just a mask and a bloody knife. Um, this is all that I have so far, but there is like another piece that I'm gonna get, which is an apron. And because I have the, you know, this uh, knife and this mask, it it will be it will end up being a butcher. That's all. Like a mad butcher, not like a an animal butcher, like some sort of crazy mad butcher that's killing people. And I'm gonna wear the costume. It kind of looks, I don't know. I uh, didn't want to go for like a full-on zombie, even though this kind of is. But maybe it could be a zombie butcher that's gone crazy. And so you know, I'll pretty much be at a table right here. And sorry if you can't really hear me that well, but you know, a table. And I could just be like, <laughs> or, I don't know what I'm going to do. It's kind of cringy if I just openly do my act right here. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to take that off. It actually broke this morning, and I had to sew one of the straps back on. So I don't want to uh, break it. So I'm going to put that away. Whoops. Whoa. I think the next time we'll be seeing that is in Halloween. So... That's just a little thing. And another thing I got at Spare Halloween, not yesterday, but uh, a couple weeks before, was this cool little flashing light. Now, in my garage, I do have, like, a couple lights in there. And I think on Halloween night, I'll just, like, the I'll unscrew those lights or something. Uh, my dad my dad had a plan. He, he knows how to do it, I guess. And we'll just put this light in one of the places where... Uh, a light was and it'll just be a flashing light so hopefully that will look pretty cool and yeah now finally this is another prop that I got like a week before I'm going to take off my wall it's, it's a uh, high voltage box these things spin around they flash and it looks pretty cool now I don't really know what I'm going to use this for I think I'm going to put it in one of the rooms just have it hanging on the wall or something, and something's going to happen. I don't know what, but, you know, someone's going to get electrocuted or something. Um, I will show you. It's pretty loud, though, so I think on the actual day I do it, and I will put some, like, duct tape, maybe one, two even layers to muffle the sound a little bit. But <clears throat> here we go. I'm going to turn it on. So I don't think that was actually at full power because I have had this on my wall for like a couple of weeks and maybe just randomly turn it on at points. So the batteries are not at full juice. I will replace them on Halloween night. But it actually looks like a pretty cool product. It was like $40 and you get this nice cool thing. The animation is really awesome. And this lever really doesn't do anything. If I turn it off, I could still turn it on like Yeah, so. Anyways, guys, uh, this was, uh, let me step back into the camera, a very short episode, uh, just a little review on some of the things that I got, and there will be more props, like, trust me, I already have a few that are in the crawl space that I might do a video on, but maybe I'll just save it for later, and yeah, uh, I think in the next video we're going to be reviewing some more in detail about the layout and some of the rooms, maybe the theme of the haunt, which I don't really have, and yeah, bye.